afa rejan e den sem atuja we say wonwa we yi wo mo say wonyi na franka tuni di bre no say ko basa ba to no kwetia wo mo a wo mo anim say ade na bo atia mo nemum say be obe chechere wo mo wo achire di won sika pia no financiers no wurenti no asha da di akodan supreme court no na ye di ye di no na to financiers na ni wo mo to aban tim say akwa no di aban wo nya ayo no obi e de chinchim ne nsa je say be ye mfie nan obe sa de wo no akọ say won ko no won ko print ama say de eh wo no wo hobi e no ho de e kwaso di munche mu ato adokase ni Dr. Farijan Kasa Yemuno, Wachere, and Yame Bia, a Koso, a Wabatumu, Ya and Fano Quanso, and Afi Quania, a manual four, a Kakan, some Eshabo, a Wabra, one num in Niswo, a Chairman four. A Bra Wakaso Constitution Day public lecture, no Asiano, or Boko Kose, and a Moa, or my Gana and Namsono, a Hupa, Nan Shayim Poa and Chokrano, one more or two aba, a Nyaji de a Wu, a manual four mubium. Ye be a Chirinaka be Mammy can be a Wame Muno, now one num at Tona Sea. It appears that some candidates rush to court with election petitions alleging manipulation of results primarily to placate their financiers and supporters so that they will be given another chance to be a candidate the next time. The rush can cause undeserved injury to the reputation of the Electoral Commission and unnecessarily inund unnecessary in inundation of the courts. As we speak, there are well over 1,000 election petitions before the courts in Nigeria following the 2023 elections. Yes, well over 1,000 election petitions. Some of them uh, will not be concluded you know, before <laughs> the next election itself. <laughs> To deter deliberate wrongdoing, all persons connected with the conduct of elections must be held strictly accountable for their actions by instituting a stringent regime of punishment for willful wrongdoing. 